Hello everyone, this is Rochelle and welcome to Attilia Sophie, the Alchemist of the Mysterious Book. This is a game that was released on Steam a few days ago. It seemed pretty fascinating, you know, as a, as a kid I always used to play these types of RPG games, you know, those Japanese types ones. Also I heard that this game was released on the PS4 so I can expect this to be a AAA title made by some rich ass company, like stated below. So without further ado, let's get into the game. Okay, break time's over. Holy crap, there's voice acting. Also, it's in English. Amazing. Now back to work. I need to put in the puni ball and then add the uni after boiling it for a little while. Yeah, this is going well. Now I just have to mix it a little and... Huh? This is weird. What's with this color? Oh, it stinks! Oh no, wait! You added the wrong ingredients? This is Kirchen Bell, a small town brimming with greenery and the sounds of church bells. A certain girl lives alone in this town. Alone? Her name is Sophie. Here, she runs an atelier, using the alchemy she learned from her late grandmother. Sorry, atelier. Although, she still has quite a lot of room for improvement. Uh, messed up again. Uh, at this rate, I'll never be as good as grandma was. Uh, if only there was a way to suddenly get really good at alchemy. Then I could make amazing medicine and stuff, and everyone in town would rely on me. <laughs> um, didn't you say alone? I wouldn't have any problems if that was the case. <sighs> Guess I should clean up. Oh, yes! It's open! Maybe I read that wrongly. Monica. Monica Elmenrach. Nrach. Hello, Sophie. What's that smell? <laughs> I messed up again. More importantly, why are you here, Monica? Do you need something? Yes, there's something I'd like to ask of you. Huh, it's unusual for you to have a request. What do you need? I just met with Meister Horst. He was asking for some Berg medicine, but I've gone to every shop and I can't find it anywhere. So I thought you might know something. You know, you're kind of an alchemist, right? That's why I'm asking. I'm not kind of one. But Berg medicine, huh? I've never tried making that. I saw Grandma making it before, so I should be able to make it too. It's a request I decided to accept. You don't have to force yourself if it'll be difficult. No, it's fine. I can't just ignore someone in need. Leave it all to me. Oh, but I'm still not confident about it, so I should look for Grandma's book. 
Uh huh. Yep. DLC, obviously. Event. Important events help out Monica 1 added. Holy crap, I can finally move. Hell fucking yes. Oh my god, I can jump. Okay, I gotta admit, this game is looks hella nice and it is kind of fun. The controls are kind of smooth. Okay, I gotta stop that. Uh, what do you want me to do again? Sorry. Should I help too? It's okay, I'll finish this quick. Just wait right here. Okay, I think I need to make a herb for her or whatever. Puny level pastry making. Nope, how to remove tough stains. Not this Iva. Uh, Monica, I can't find it. That's because you don't keep this place organized. I'll help you clean up again on another day. Just keep looking for now. It has a very elegant binding. I wonder what's inside. Let's take a look. I see, I see. Ah, oh, this is a reference book for alchemy. But only the beginning is. The rest of it is all blank pages. Maybe Grandma was writing it. Hmm, I see. Yeah! Anyway, Monica, after looking at this, I suddenly remembered. Huh? Remembered what? How to make the bird medicine! The thing you were asking about! Really? You think you can make it? Of course! I have enough materials so I can mix it up real quick now! Yes, please do so! Just be careful not to make another mistake, okay? I'll be fine! Just leave it to me! You can synthesize items by accessing the Alchemy Cauldron. Accessing this desk allows you to save and load the game. You can set the time to whenever you like by sleeping in the bed. If you return to the Otelia, how the hell do you pronounce that again? But late at night, you will automatically rest until morning. Alright, I need to create this Berg medicine for that lady. Important events help out Monica 2 added. Let's save the game. Game save. How can I access my options? Here we go. Sophie, level 1. Typical RPG stuff. Yep, yep, yep. Seems like it's all normal stuff. Unibag, eh? Magic grass, monster feather, well water. Grandma's cauldron. Why the hell do I have this? Inside my backpack? Oh, container. Looking through grandma's books reminded me how to make the bird medicine. Yeah, I should try synthesizing it. And that I shall. But first, I'm gonna have to look around a little bit more. Can I take a nap? I mean, I, I do feel okay. I don't feel tired, I guess. Your outfit is pretty nice. Looks like you're ready for camping with that little backpack of yours. Anyway, let's start synthesizing stuff. Alright, time to try making it. <laughs> Good luck, Sophie. Leave it to me. Okay, what should I make? To synthesize items, you first select one of the recipes that you have learned. Synthesis requires you to have the de designated items. You can check which recipes you can make by looking at the zero. Uh, okay. Can synthesize now. After making materials, and not enough. I use this key as a quick reference to see which recipes you can make. Um, circle means means good, right? After choosing the recipe, you will select the materials. Some material requirements are specific items, but they can also be categories of items like water. When a category 
is designated, you can freely select any item you want from the category. However, each item also has a different category value that represents its affinity with that category. The category value is displayed in the items icon lower right as a number. The number's color represents the item's color. You can press X to swap the item, information to check the item's categories and category values all at once. Sure, typical RPG stuff, what's new? Alright, let's submenu. Sort and filter. Plant. Uh, yeah. It's the same. Uh, pressing A to select an item will place a check mark over the item count. The window on the right displays quality, effect value, size, and use count. Alright. Average quality, total value, average size. Can increase up to three times as size grows to certain points. Oh, it's... What's this 10? Is it the amount that heals me? Maybe I didn't read it properly. Anyway, Monster Feather. Seems like I have 10 of it as well. And then I have water, so... Is this really okay? After choosing all the materials, you will start synthesis. Select Synthesize to start. Alright, I'll finish it now. Ten! Hell fucking yes. So, HP recovery. Hmm. this over to Meister Horse now. Right! Hey Monica, do you mind if I go along? Huh? I don't mind, but why? I'm the one who made this medicine. If it turned out to be no good, it would mean trouble. Hmm. I think it's fine, but... Well, it couldn't hurt. Let's go. Yeah! Oh, just a minute! I should write the recipe into the reference book while it's still fresh in my mind. Sorry for the wait, Monica. Anyway, let's go see Meister Horse. Did you say Meister Horse or Mr. Horse? This is an adorable game so far, I'm liking it. As you can expect from a triple A title, the graphics are good, there are voice acting for it. Meister Horse! This is certainly not an indie game, that's for sure. Who's Basla? Ah, you two. Do you need anything? Meister Horst, I brought the Berg medicine you requested. Oh, thank you very much for bringing it so quickly, Monica. Well, actually, Sophie made it. I couldn't find any Berg medicine myself. Sophie, you made this? Yes, um, is there something wrong with it? Not at all. In fact, it's quite rare to see Berg medicine as fine as this. It seems your skills with alchemy are improving quite a bit, Sophie. <laughs> <laughs> you two have been very helpful. Here's your payment. Just 200. Fuck you, dude. Wow, thank you so much, Meister Horse. Oh, maybe 200 is a lot. Thanks, I guess. Um, I didn't really do anything. I can't accept this. No, no. I'm the one who made such a sudden request. Think of it as a payment for your time. I insist. Very well. I'll accept it gratefully. Thank you too, Sophie. If you are ever troubled by anything, just ask. I'll do whatever I can to help. Anyway, I'll get going now. Have a good day, Meister Horst. Sophie? Why do they say Meister? Yes, have a good day. I like this guy, he has a monocle. Oh, never mind, I'm going back to my own house. <sighs> I worked hard today. Are you kidding me? Huh? You just made one recipe. What? That book is floating? I, I didn't think books could do that. You just...
just got home, and you're already so loud. Oh, sorry! Wait, what? Did the book just talk? Yep. Yes, I talked. What? The book... The book is talking? Please just calm down. People are able to talk. It's not strange for a book to talk, too. Huh? Um... I don't think that's how it works. Um... So you're that reference book from earlier, right? The one I wrote in? Yes, I'm Plakta. Okay. That is very fucking weird. Oh, you have a name. I'm Sophie. Sophie. I shall remember that. Um, Miss Plakta? Why the fuck are you flying? And why are you alive? Just call me Plakta. Uh, okay. Um, Plakta? What exactly are you? A book. Well, no fucking shit. I can see that, but... You're a book. Yet you're flying and talking. It's really strange. It's true that I'm different from an ordinary book. That's because I... I... That's strange. I can't remember. What exactly am I? A book. Um, that's what I want to know. Wait, Plakta. Do you not have any memories? It seems so. I can remember that I'm related to alchemy, though. Alchemy? Then I might be able to help! I'm actually an alchemist! Yes, I know. A novice alchemist who doesn't even know how to produce Berg medicine. Hey, shut the fuck up. You're just a book. Oh, so you saw that. But I can make it now. Even a child could make that if they studied a little bit. Uh, but, but, Meister Horse praised me for it. Saying from my point of view, it didn't appear particularly excellent in any way. Oh, my god, a book is sassing me. Yeah terrible at alchemy. I make lots of mistakes. And I can't make lots of things. I can't help the people around town like my grandma was able to. Do you wish to become better? Huh? I'm asking you if you wish to become better at alchemy. Of course I do. I would if I could. There is a device called the Cauldron of Knowledge. It allows anyone to use the power of alchemy. With that, you would be able to make free use of alchemy, as you so desire. There's an amazing device like that? I want it! Where can I find it? The Cauldron of Knowledge is... Oh, this is strange. Oh no, don't tell me. Plakta, you forgot where the cauldron is? Hey, and you called me useless. It seems so. What? Are you serious? That's terrible! got my hopes up only to crush them I'm very sorry but I can't remember at all as compensation I can teach you alchemy myself I may have lost my memories but I'm confident that my knowledge of alchemy exceeds yours fine hmm you do seem pretty smart and you probably do know more about alchemy than me what do you mean hmm do you seem pretty smart it's a fucking book if you'll teach me I'll gladly accept. Very well. We'll be working together starting now, Sophie. Yeah! I look forward to it, Plakta. Oh my fucking god. Holy shit, the opening is very, very loud. Okay. <laughs> this is totally anime.
Alright, so that was the prologue. 20 minutes in and we've only finished the prologue. I guess here comes the main part of the game. Okay, let's not waste any time. Can you teach me some stuff, Pakta? Yeah, teach me shit. You're quite enthusiastic. Yeah, I don't want to be a novice forever. <laughs> Very well. Try synthesizing something first. Synthesis? I can do that. Let's see, materials, materials... Oh, what's wrong? Oh, what? I used all my materials when I made that bird medicine. I have nothing left. Well, time to hunt some monsters down then. Then it seems you need to gather some. Is there a place nearby where you can do that? Yeah, I know of a place, but... Puni appeared there, so I'm scared to go alone. Oh, right! I can have Monica come with me. Monica, is that the girl who was with you yesterday? Yeah, she's actually really strong. I see. Then you should be safe. Very well, please be careful. Huh? You're not coming too? As you can see, even if I was to go, I wouldn't be able to fight. Seeing how I'm a book and all. Well, you're pretty useless for a book, aren't you? Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll be off then. Yes. Try to come back quickly. Time is finite after all. I'll take my own fucking time. If you take too long, I won't have as much time to teach you alchemy. Okay, fine, I'll rush. <laughs> You're right. Okay, I'll try to hurry back. Yay, I can move around again. Fucking finally. Alright, I need to go find Monica and stuff. Let me check the settings for a little bit. Huh, easy. All seems good. All seems good. Alright, we need to go look for Monica because if we try to do shit ourselves, we're gonna get our ass kicked. Can I save the game at least? Alright. Now let us go on an adventure of a lifetime. Time will pass when Sophie takes action such as moving or synthesis. Would you like to view the explanation for the passage of time? Hit me. You can see the current time and date in the upper left corner of the screen. Movement, exploration, synthesis and other actions will cause time to slowly pass. The time can cause changes in monster present, gatherable items, etc. A week consists of 5 days called sprout, bud, flower, fruit and seed. Fruit and seed are the weekend and the people around town will be doing different things than during the week. A month consists of 30 days. The current date will display on the calendar in the upper left corner of the screen. Alright. I understand. I guess. Alright, finally we're out of our house. We're free to move around. Well, adventure time I guess. Looking for Monica, I think I saw her in the plaza earlier, earlier. The hill from the plaza to the edge of the town is really hard on an old lady. Okay, so I gotta go to the, to the, whatever. Uh, I don't think I wanna go to the world map. How about I head here? Yeah. Okay, Monica should or should not be around here, I don't know. Now then, I guess I'll head to the main street to go shopping. But first I need to go visit the church in the plaza and pray. Oh, relig religious, religious up hippo. Okay, I get it. The graphics are pretty good for the PC port of this game. You may have noticed already in the start. Alright, we're at the plaza. Hopefully Monica will be here. Huh, what a Monica, coincidence. Will you come gathering with me? Hmm? Why are you asking all of a sudden? I don't have any materials for synthesis. I want to go gather some, but I'm scared to go alone. Ah, I see. Of course I'll go. Besides, you helped me with Meister Horse request. All right, thanks, Monica. No problem. By the way, Sophie, have you outfitted yourself properly? Huh? Yeah, I have my handkerchief and snacks. That's not what I meant. You need medicine and other supplies, right? 
We're going to a place where monsters appear. You need to prepare properly. Oh, you're right. I'll be sure to bring some stuff. Alright. Might have to join my party. I guess I'm gonna have to buy some items and weapons before heading out. Bombs and medicines, equipping this item, take out item, use them. I think I'm good. You can read more details about equipping items under help in the encyclopedia. Important events, go gather materials to add it. Okay. Uh, we should head out, but nah, I'll go to the church later. Why the hell would I have to pray? I'm planning to go hunting outside after making preparations on Main Street. Maybe I'll take a look at the request over at Horse Shop, too. I'll go get some medicine and yeah. Why, if it isn't Sophie and Monica, are you going somewhere? Marguerite Belmer. Oh, Mrs. Marguerite. Yes, I'm going to help Sophie gather materials. Right, Sophie? Wow, these are nice. Your vegetables look so tasty today, too. Yum. Yum, indeed. <laughs> it seems Sophie is charmed by my vegetables again. Sophie. Huh? Oh, right. Yeah, we're going to go gathering. I see, I see. Make sure to be careful. Yes, thank you for your concern. That makes me wonder where my foolish son wandered off to. If you see him, tell him I'm looking for him. Got it. I'll let him know if I see him. Anyway, we'll be going now. Yes, take care. Okay, back to... Back to doing shit. Oh, hey. Oh, yo. Oh, yay. Okay, that's weird. Mmm, vegetables. Okay, gotta go find her son, right? Whatever. You look... You look pretty young. Actually, you look like you're a middle-aged adult. Just very hot. Right, I should... Is this Miss Meister Horse? Uh, store is closed due to interior cleaning. Vegetable shop. Lock. The shop owner doesn't seem to be here. Okay, maybe we might want to go to the town entrance, I guess. Welcome to Kirchen Bell. I can guide you if you need anything. This looks like the... Oh, yeah, this is the world map. I'm gonna have to find her son or something. I still need to buy equipment, right? Uh, how the fuck am I gonna... Okay, you know what? Fuck buying stuff. Let's just go kill... Kill every single fucking... Thing out there in the wilderness now. Where are we going next? Not gonna answer? You need to be more careful. We have no idea when monsters could appear. I know. Wait, is someone over there? That's... Hey, Oscar! Oh great, it's a fat ass. Uh, Oscar Belmer. Oh, Sophie and Monica. What are you doing out here? Your voice doesn't suit you. Alchemy materials. What about you? I came to observe the plants. The plants here tell some interesting stories. Oscar, don't tell me you were talking to plants again. That's exactly what I was doing. What's weird about that? 
To me, it's weirder not to be able to talk to plants. Yeah, you were always like this. I don't really intend to argue after all this time. That sounded vaguely like an insult. Oh, right. Oscar, Mrs. Marguerite was looking for you. <laughs> oh, crap! I totally forgot about my delivery! Mom's gonna scold me! This is your own fault. Just accept it, Oscar. Huh? What was that sound? Oh, it's so adorable. It's a little, uh, pony. little smiley face too. Sophie, stand back. Oscar, you can fight, right? What? Wait a second. I'm not prepared for this. Here they come. Sure. Finally, we're getting into the battles. In battle, enemy and allies will take turns performing actions. Once the enemy actions are determined, you will be able to select actions for your party. You can use commands for various actions. Select with that and then, then press A to confirm. The action order is displayed on the left and go in order from the top. The order can often change depending on actions performed. Furthermore, an important factor in battle is stance. There are two types of stances, an offense and defense. Stance can be switched anytime while selecting commands by pressing the L, R, uh, yeah, they have different perks. Choosing offense will increase your attack power. Simple enough. Uh-huh. Support attacks, uh, additional attacks. Choosing defense will increase, surprisingly, your defense. Support guard, yeah. Will automatically be used when the chain link gauge is filled to 100%. The type of support action is determined by your current stance. You gain an advantage in battle by checking the enemy's actions and choosing the appropriate stance. Make good use of the information displayed in the turn list. Alright, let's take these guys out quick. I'm gonna fucking kick your ass! Everybody, go on the offensive. Um, reduce enemy attack power? Alright. Light edge! On the blue puny. And then you. Uh, skills with attack power. Nah, you don't need to heal at the moment. Attack that blue puny, fat boy! And you, the main character. Magic damage, enemy, area single. Alright, attack that blue puny with aura blitz. Begin to fucking turn. Ouch. Sword of light. Yeah. Hardly put up a fight. Oh, that was it. All right. I guess this is basically the battle. Puny ball got a uh, stuff. I guess. I thought I was going to die. You're fine. You both appear uninjured. Yeah, somehow. I didn't think they'd attack all of a sudden like that. Hey, Oscar. Do you want to come with us? It's dangerous to be alone. Monsters could attack again. You're probably right. Alright, I'll go with you. I wouldn't want to get hurt after all. In that case, let's get started with the gathering. Oh, you need to help too, Oscar. What? I never said I'd do that. So you won't tell Mrs. Marguerite we saw you here. Okay? Uh, fine, I got it. Oscar joined your party. Would you like to view the explanation for gathering points and enemy symbols? Huh? Uh huh. Gather items. Well, touching an enemy symbol will start a battle. If you hit the enemy by swimming, swinging your staff. Uh huh. Pressing X seems seems easy enough. Okay. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, I got some herbs. That 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 that's All it. Right. This should be plenty. Jesus Christ. That was fast. <sighs> Talk about using people. What should we do, Sophie? Wanna look around a little more? Huh? No way, that's enough! I'm exhausted. And if we stick around too long, some dangerous monsters could appear. Oscar might be right. Okay then, let's head back. Yeah. Oh, both of you should drop by the Atlia. I'll make tea for you. Atlia. Oh, really? Then we'll take you up on that offer. Right, Oscar? Yeah. But first, let me catch my breath. Great. More explanations. 
Aha, uh -huh. reduce your abilities, avoid battles while low on L LP. Exploring the same field multiple times will allow you to get better materials. However, the enemies will go stronger. Time and weather can also affect the materials you gather and the monsters that appear. That's pretty much it then. Alright. Uh, oh boy. Um, should we go back? There's a house here, you know. Open, open, open. All right, fine. Don't open up then. Uh, all right, let's go back, I suppose. Where are we going next? Well, obviously, we're gonna go back. And that's that. Um, how do we... Okay. We're back! Ah, oh, welcome back. That took a long time. Book is floating a and talking. I never thought I'd hear the voices of books in addition to plants. N no, Oscar, it isn't just you. I can hear it too. This time, Sophie, it seems your friends are just as loud as you are. <laughs> I'm pretty sure anyone would be surprised if they saw you, Plakta. Um, both of you, this is. Mm hmm You wrote something in a reference book and it started talking? Sounds more like a dream. I never thought that book would turn out to be something this amazing. I was shocked at first, too. I mean, a book was flying and talking after all. I don't think it's that shocking. No, it is. So, um... Miss Plakta? Just call me Plakta. Oh, okay then. Plakta? What or who are you? Ah, I asked the same question, but it seems like Plakta doesn't have any memories. Really? Yes, the only things I know are my name and a little knowledge of alchemy. Right! That's why I want to figure out a way to get her memories back. Memories, huh? Maybe they'll come back if you found some sort of clue? A clue? Oh, Sophie! I just thought of something. Plakta started talking because you wrote something in the book, right? Yeah, I think that did it. Then maybe her memories will return if you write more recipes into the book? Wow, that makes sense. You're pretty sharp, Monica. What do you think, Plakta? It doesn't sound far-fetched. I think it would be worth trying. Okay. In that case, I'll study lots of alchemy and write lots of recipes into you. That sounds strangely inappropriate. I feel like some sort of fate brought us here. If there's anything I can help with, let me know. Yeah, I'll help with whatever I can too. Thank you both. Whoa, it's getting late. I need to get home or Mom will scold me again. I'll be leaving as well. See you later, Sophie and Plakta. Yeah, see you! I need to work hard for Plakta. Yes, I have high hopes, Sophie. Ah, <sighs> send obtained items to the container. Got a pewdie ball. I guess I can make more stuff now. Alright, so this is all the time I have for this episode here for Atelier Sophie. This game is as I expected it. It's a AAA title, so the graphics are good, voice acting is good, story is good. Everything is pretty much as it should be for a Japanese RPG game. Nothing that special. Um, what I do really like is how the port... Um, you know is uh much more cleaner i guess because you know pcs always have better graphics oh no people are gonna get come after me because i said that um yeah anything else that's pretty much it i suppose so let me know what you peeps feel about this game i appreciate the feedback also check the annotations for more games that i've played before and i'll see you guys in the next video or whatever i make Oh, wait, wait, I'm not done yet. Um, you guys might know if I want to actually play more of this. Um, 
these type of AAA games might actually take quite a long time. I don't know, like maybe 20 hours or 30 hours of playtime, so I don't think I'll actually be doing a full playthrough of this. This is more of a Vero looks at than a Vero plays completely. So yeah, but if you guys really enjoyed these se this series, then of course I would be glad to put in more time and effort into it. But that's it for now. So yeah, I guess that's it. Thanks everyone for watching, I guess. Stay frosty, y'all.